Welcome back to the States and we're doing tornadoes here and it has been relatively quiet this year, not too really relatively, but um, there is going to be a difference uh, where even though the season gets started around about February, I am seeing because of some storm in at the end of February, you're going to have isolated tornadoes and it'll be so there's my stick um round right about here in kentucky and it's involving uh, not only the it's not the snow so much there is a rainstorm and um a weird weather system now i'm not going to talk about every one of them but um there will be an increase from this year 2018's uh, tornadoes it was relatively quiet but on 2019 I'm seeing that there is a possibility of one F5 and that is going to be round about here in South Dakota it's a it's, it's a storm system that's coming in here and um, that will be uh, coming in late August then there is um, how can I say this um, and there's going to be several storms it's going to be not exactly 100% more than this year, but I'm going to say there'll be a total, and that's including F0s up to F5s, um, but literally it's a majority of F0 through F2s, and um, that will be a good 325 or something, and that will be in the, the main ones of those ones, the lower caliber will be here. There's going to be more in Dallas round about here, Oklahoma, Kansas, and it's it's kind of from here onwards that you're going to see it. There are going to be two uh, significant ones, that would say about an F1, F2, in um, Orlando, round about Orlando, Jacksonville. But um, it's really going, it's kind of a water spout, but it, it's as if some kind of weather effects, and I think it's the hurricane that it's going to come in there um, visit that which we'll talk in another video but basically um, the F2s I'm seeing about um, sorry F3s I apologize F3s I'm seeing um, F2s are about 17 maybe more or um, actually far more than that I'm sorry F3s I'm seeing about 12 to 17 and they are um, coming in again as clusters they're not individual the F5, which is going to have uh, kind of a trailing F0s to um, F2s and F3, uh, not so much F3s, but F2s. Uh, but the F5 is, again, around about here that I'm seeing. So um, that'll be about, as I said, in August. The F4 um, is going to be round about here, Kansas in this it's as if it's going to be a very very dry summer we'll talk about heat another one video but it's going to be an extremely dry dry summer and fires as well we'll be doing um, but basically um, there's uh, quite a bit the activity really starts um, there's going to be a, a an, I wouldn't say about 17 tornadoes run in April May, it's kind of quiet. June, around about June 12th to the 17th, it starts really ramping up again. And that's when you're going to see July, August, <coughs> excuse me, oh, July, August, um, that you're going to see the larger clusters and the storm activity. A lot of, dra um, with the tornadoes, you're going to see a lot of flooding, I'm afraid. Um, and that is something, again, I'll talk about on a separate video. So I'm af afraid there is going to be um, significant damage with the F5 and there may be as much as four F4s, but I think it's more F3s. One could be an F3, so um, count on at least th uh, three F3s, okay? And that, again, is in this section here, okay? In this section all right and that's it i'm doing them um very quickly these videos so people don't get too bored all right well you don't need to watch but thank you i hope it helps some people